Hey, Milton. Can you give me a hand with this fence? Sure. Know much about fence building? Not really. <laughs> can't build a fence, can't milk a cow, ain't used to shoveling shits, but took on a gang of robbers single-handed. Guess we all got our peculiarities, Mr. Dickens. What was you doing before you came here? I told you. Wife got cheated out of inheritance. We was in a legal dispute. It was a bad time. That sounds awful, but I guess I don't believe a word of it. I was raised to take a man at his word, and also to believe this is a free country. So free that I can't tell you what to think. So I guess it don't much matter what you believe. But I will work hard, and I learn fast. Okay. Give me a hand with this fence. Yep, there's plenty more to do. Pound it in there. We don't want it coming down. Good. Now grab a rail, line it up with a notch, and place it in. Now, lift up the other side. They gotta line up, see? Now the next rail. Fine. Good. Okay. That looks okay. Go to the next post and pound that in. I hope you've grasped the basics. I got other matters to attend to, but there's more than a day's work here for you. All right. So long. I'll be counting sections when you're done. Okay. Give us a hand. Be easy, bro. How much about bulls, Milton? Uh, just the basics. Don't make them mad. Angus Geddes, this is Jim Milton. Mr. Milton? Angus is your boss's son. Nice to meet you. Well, let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. Come on! Move! Oh, oh. Oh, shit! I'll get him. Get a rope on You don't look like you're gonna wind down, <laughs> but I'll try. There, there. There, there. Oh, there. Oh, there. Easy, easy. It ain't so bad. Nice and easy now, boy. All better? Okay. 
Now come on, you hunk of chuck. Come on. Come on. Got him, Mr. Dickens. Oh, good. How you doing, son? A bit sore, but I'll be okay. Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. And you, mister? Fine. He just got my head. <laughs> good. There he is. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. your mouth, boy. You will be the first one we kill. Yeah. Leave him alone. <laughs> oh, careful, boys. Careful. Yeah. Look at this tough guy. Get out of here. How oh, fancy pants get. He's paying you to be tough for him, huh? <laughs> <laughs> no, he's paying me to keep the place clean. Oh. He said he had some problems with vermin. Oh, listen to this. Real funny. <laughs> no! Oh, oh, you go get him now. Come on, get him. Oh, kick his head in, Bob. Get that feller. <laughs> yeah? They didn't hire you because you're tough. It's because you're stupid. Knock his goddamn brains out. Oh, he's licking you, boss. <laughs> You need help? Ah. Uh. Oh, oh, get off that man! Get off! He hit me first. Oh, you can fight, boy. I'll give you that. Well, how's your wife in a brawl? Leave my wife alone. Oh, she's real pretty. Get out of here! Oh, quite a temper you got. Imagine you're you're frustrated with your lot in life, married to a shit shoveling farmhand. <laughs> What'd you do wrong to end up here? Leave my wife alone. Welcome to Big Valley, Jim Milton. Pleasure to meet you both. We'll see you again. And you, boy, tell Mr. Geddes we called. We'll be back. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Milton. Thank you. Don't worry about it. You stop acting like a goddamn storybook hero, will ya? What choice did I have? Plenty, you moron. Plenty. We all get caught eventually, John. I guess the trick is to decide by who. Now, dear, I won't hear any more of it. You won't hear any of it. Not in front of the men. You toad. 